So where we're heading is that we are going to be doing database access from Flask. Before we get there, let's have a little look at databases. You're probably a bit unfamiliar with them. Um, we're just going to be doing single table databases. And I've got a table here of Pokemon. And you can see it's a bunch of fields like Pokemon name, what type one is, what type two is, HP, etc. So each of these is a field and each one of these Pokemon is a record. And you can see we've got different types of data. So the Pokemon name is text and the and HP, for instance, is numbers. And we can see we actually set that. If I go into the setup for this table, uh, it actually says we've got to those fields, Pokemon name, type one, type two, total HP. And some of them are text and some of them are integers, whole numbers. Uh, and there's a whole bunch of different field types that we can use. Uh, for instance, if we want decimal numbers, we wouldn't want integer. We would go with something different, maybe one of these down here, um, etc. We don't need to get too deep into that right now. All you need to know is the database in this case is just going to start off as a single table and we've got um, different field types. Now, the way you're going to do some learning here is on W3Schools. So you're going to learn a little bit about how we access that database from within Flask. Uh, and it's all using SQL. So um, we see things like select these fields from this table, select these columns from this table, etc. You're going to teach yourself this. You've chosen to um, work through this independently, so you have to kind of work it through. Um, what you need to do to get going with what we're up to is uh, you need to understand how select works. You can read these intros as well if you want to. Select distinct, you might as well. We, we don't seem to find much use for that, but you will definitely need to look at where the order by and these and or and not um, ones as well. So these are all things that you should do some learning on and make sure you learn it properly. So for instance, these ones, you can click try it yourself and this is the SQL and we run it. And it says these are the countries which are not Spain. And if we took out the not, for instance, where country equals Spain, these are the countries where the country, these are the records where the country is Spain. Pretty straightforward. And if you play around with these and run the SQL, you'll be set, ready for the next video where we actually do some of this SQL in Flask.